Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Today I'm going to share with you my favorite, favorite items of this month. The first favorite item is my son's favorite pair of shoes right here. I got them from Zara. Uh, ever since I got them, he's been just loving these uh, on him. He now turned two, so he now start to pick things for himself so whenever i say let's go outside then he will always go and grab these pair of shoes and he will tell me to put them on him so yeah then i know that these are his favorite and i absolutely love them so much he's been wearing it every single day since i got them and yeah, these have a little bit of height that kind of makes him a little taller and I think it's really really comfortable. I can really feel the cushion inside and these are really easy to just put them on right in and they never slip off out of his small feet. So I've been really loving them and these blue color, it goes really well with every outfit that I pair for him. Here's a little brown color here and leather right here that's really fancy right the color here is solid blue and here is navy blue on the bag it's just little details i absolutely love them i think i paid 35 dollars for these and love 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 very very well made love them and this month i've been eating a lot of snacks so i just wanted to share with you guys my Actually, this is my all-time uh, favorite snack that I love to snack up. So these, as you can see, I'm a Korean, so I do know things uh, that are Korean products. So I love this. Uh, even when I was in Korea, that's well back, right? So yeah, every time I get to go to Korean supermarket, um, I get to buy this whole pack and I actually got two of these big boxes and inside it looks like so and it's really really great it's not too sweet it's just it just has a really great thick just cracker let me tell you guys what's in it it has sunflower oil palm oil rosemary it has the sesame seed on the top and it does have a little sugar but it's not like sugary taste I absolutely recommend you guys to go and check this out if you're near Korea market, things like that. We call it Gosomi. That's the name for it. So that's that. And the next item, uh, the snack again. I love sweet uh, things. Uh, here is my all-time favorite again, candy that I love. Is I've been eating it a lot, so don't have much left. But yeah, we, we've been uh, out of town for like the weekend trip that we made. I think we, we went many times this whole month. So anyways, I was snacking them in the car uh, going on the way to the city. Anyways, so here is my favorite. I absolutely love it. It's not just sweet. It's a candy, of course. It has to be sweet, but not just sweet, but it has a sour taste to it. I love, love, love sour stuff. So anyways, this is a green grape candy. It has the vitamin C. That's what it says right here. And the name is Cheongpodo. That's the Korean name for it. So if you love candy and you love taste that's not just solid, sugary candy taste, I will highly recommend you guys to go and check this out at the Korean store. Okay, speaking of Korean stuff, I really didn't want to share this, but because I do want to share good things with you guys uh, for food, this, oh my goodness, this is very bad. I mean, I don't want to recommend to anyone who really loves ramen because you're going to love this stuff. Uh, if you love spicy food, uh, Sorry guys, I feel like kind of embarrassed to say, but anyways, uh, you know, whenever, you know, we woman, whenever the time comes every month, I crave for this like crazy. So it's not a great thing to eat, I would say. The name is Noguri and you can find this 
you know, an Asian supermarket, I believe. This is very popular in Korea and this has been around uh, in Korea for years and years. This was my favorite uh, ramen when I was in high school also. So that's a long time, right? So anyways, it is udon type noodles. It has a little fatty, like thick uh, noodle type and I absolutely love it. I love spicy food, but my husband doesn't really like spicy food. So I don't really get to cook because you know he doesn't like it so I don't want to just cook separate things for me and him so I don't really cook spicy food even though I really love it so this I <laughs> eat sometimes and uh, I really enjoy whenever I get to eat it so I highly recommend uh, those who love spicy food and like to try something new and you don't really care about how healthy or it's not a great thing but it doesn't have MSG but whenever you don't have food to cook or anyways just saying right <laughs> yeah so that's my favorite ramen it's all-time favorite uh, ramen that I have and I told you guys I have a lot of food uh, this is another snack that I actually found this um, let me show you the package first 70 dried mangoes uh, if you know what this is and love this please give this video a thumbs up i don't know just for fun right because oh my goodness i do not really like dried fruit in general because i love just fruit just you know real fruit i'm like why do you need to get the dried fruit you know when they are too sweet and very dry i don't really really see the point of buying them and eating them actually but this really changed everything uh, I actually got the exact same one when I was in Hawaii and I wanted to try their mango but it's not really from Hawaii uh, when I read it anyways so I bought the pack of it and I started to you know taste it and I just oh, love it it's juicy it does have sugar but it's not sugary sugary dried fruit type of yeah fruit love it so much and i got this of course i finished the whole pack with my son he loves it and he likes to snack on it too so we, we finished the whole thing really you know quickly and i tried to find the same one online and i found the i found these at amazon.com and I just love them so much it's so dangerous because once I open it I finish the whole thing right then so yeah anyways just yeah I'll put every links down below um, and here is another snack I know I need to stop right but here is the snack that my husband and I both love my husband really doesn't like chocolate but I love chocolate and I love dark chocolate especially and but he loves this stuff because it's not too too sweet and it does have dark chocolate with the pretzels uh, pretzels dipped with dark chocolate as you can see it's just so tasty I mean I love this this I bought it at Costco you can get them uh, just favorite favorite snack that you know cannot go wrong love it so much so that's enough of talking about fruit uh, so now let me go into uh, the hair stuff that I one thing that I have because uh, my subby I forgot your name but anyway she asked me my hair has been changed a little bit like looks more shiny and you know things like that and I believe that because of this thing I got uh, I went to hair salon to dye my root of my hair um, when I was in Texas I think anyways I went to hair salon and I got my hair done and I was telling him like oh my hair is so poofy and very dry and because I do get you know hair color uh, treated every once in a while so it's just really hard to keep my hair looking shiny and you know all that good stuff so I asked him and he said he recommended this item that they had in the store normally I don't go for that because normally they're really expensive and they don't normally work for me before you know in the past experience whenever I listen to them I 
just ended up like oh you know wasting money so i didn't want to go for it but he was i just trusted him and he was a very very good hairstylist so anyways this was in that store i am not sure if you can find the same one it is japanese brand i love this conditional i I don't know it's just so it changed everything for my hair I don't know if you can really see that but it's so much more shiny and it kind of calms my hair down that I have really poofy and a lot of thick thick hair uh, this really helped my hair so much and if I can find this at Amazon or eBay or somewhere I'll put the link down below it is just wonderful I don't use this like this but I pull this you can open it. I pulled this into the little uh, the container that I got from Daiso. Uh, yeah, anyways, I used that with the pumping uh, container and I love, 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 cannot stop talking about it. And uh, if I go back to the Texas next time, I will definitely go uh, and check this out and I mean, buy another one because it was pricey. It was like I think $75 for this whole thing but I've been using it for a while now and it's been just you know don't go that much because I just can use just a little bit of amount so that is what I got and here is my nail polish thing uh, I think some of you guys asked me what this nail polish uh, name and where I got it this is just um, wine, I think I would say wine color. Um, it's just really, really appropriate for the fall and winter. This is from X Formula, of course, from Sephora. And the name is Obsessed. So you guys can get obsessed with this. I love the color. I've had this a year, I think, and still, yeah. A lot left and I am thinking of getting another one uh, just because I really really love it and I don't know yeah I really love it and I think it cost ten dollars I think at Sephora and here some of you guys asked me like many times like what do I use to keep my nail shiny and last a long time it's right here this is these two always go together uh, of course this is in the middle right here so i use this first this is nail strengthener i think yeah nail strengthener yeah so i put this like base coat i don't use base coat normally i don't know many i tried didn't really work so x formula this is uh really popular i didn't really know that but when i read the review uh this was really popular i bought this just because i was at the sephora one time so but I love it and this is almost gone so I will I already repurchased it uh, yeah that's that so this is the obsessed that has been my favorite of the month and this is Sechi Vita is a v Vite or I don't know how you pronounce it but uh, this nail polish not the nail polish this is a top coat and this really makes you know nail every nail polish really really shiny for a long time so that's that for this i've had this for about four days now and they don't really chip that quick you know so that's why i'm you know still with x formula i love that uh brand here is my favorite mask of the month actually i shared this product few months ago I think when I got them uh, as a pack I think uh, from Sephora when they were having 20% something like that anyways I got them to test them out and I think in my video I said I don't really like it especially this one but I love it now because I didn't use it in a correct way at that time which I found out later on and I absolutely love 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 it's uh they're from fresh is that right yeah fresh and sugar face polish it's just you have to try this out if you guys like to uh make your skin better i really really love it it's this natural exfoliant uh exfoliant with real strawberry seeds it refines and nourishes it really does a good good job and it says fresh sugar face polish with nourishing brown sugar isn't inevitable no innovative 
innovative, sorry guys, formula for all skin types that exfoliates and hydrates the skin, instantly revealing a softer, smoother, more radiant complexion. Has brown sugar and has real wild uh, strawberries, also uh, plum seed oil, and there's so many great, great stuff in here. And the great thing about this is that it doesn't take too long for me to use it. I, of course, I have a two years old stuff with me, around with me, I mean, around me. And I like to, of course, I like to keep my skin nice and soft, but I don't really get to have time you know long time for me to just do something on my face you guys all know what i'm talking about so this works really well i just need to rub on my face like massage it, it exfoliates and just leave it like five minutes or ten minutes and i wash off oh my skin feels so much better and then after that i put this on this was in the set together actually three came and these two are my favorite well, let me show you guys what it looks like Oops. Ooh, ooh. Okay, here is the brown sugar with the strawberry. See, you can see it smells so, so, so good. So that's what that mask looks like. And this one is rosemary. I mean, not the rosemary. Uh, rose face mask. It smells like just like rose uh, flower. And it's just... Oh, love the smell first it looks like jelly uh, for you to just dig in and eat but this makes my skin so so glowy and uh, anyways you guys have to try these out that's my um favorite and here is my favorite lipstick of the month actually the one that i'm wearing is from chanel but i'll leave the link down below and this one actually i got it from sephora as a sample kit i think uh they sent to me I mean, I chose that with the 100% point, I think, a while back. And I got two of these, same one, because I got one and I really liked it. The name is, I mean, the product is uh, Smashbox and the name is Disco Rose, I think. Yeah, and I put this on a few of my videos, I think, and I got compliments from you guys. And it it's just like, um, it looks kind of strong i think you know in the tube but it's not a strong like you know op color but it is glossy and very shiny it's not sticky on your lips and it lasts really really long time and it's so shiny and i love the color it looks like you know just a better than your lip color type of color lipstick not lipstick lip gloss so i highly recommend you guys to try this out if you guys like something that i mean this one i've been having this in my purse all the time and whenever i want to change my lips color or looks kind of techy or things like that during the day i just you know like remove the lipstick and i put this on and it just looks like very very young and fresh so that's what i have right there and fashion items that I want to show you guys actually first thing i want to show you is this pants right here that i'm wearing i got these from zara um i think you guys seen it uh i really love them it's like really tight skinny jean but they are really really comfortable um just like jeggings or something like that and it has a little bit of rip right here with off uh just a little bit so it's not too much and it just hugs my <laughs> legs to make look a little more skinny i believe so i really love that and on the bottom this area it has just ripped off i really like that look it looks very chic so i have i really been loving it i've been wearing it a lot so and this jacket a lot of you guys comment on my entire handbag collection video that i was wearing this jacket and it is size small um, many of you guys asked me and so love 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 it's not real uh suede uh leather or anything like that but it will last really long time i can tell and looks like real <laughs> and it was 99 i think and it's been restocked and 
gone again. I one time I checked and it was all gone again and I think they will bring them out again I believe. So if you find this one in the store I would say go grab it because this really makes you look more slim and more flattering and I just love it. It just looks so 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 great. And when I think of fall and winter I just automatically I think of shawl. So of course I have to share with you guys the scarf that I've been loving uh, this month is my Burberry um, the giant check I think that's the name for it this is the color brown let me show you how it looks on me I already have the Louis Vuitton shawl that I'm wearing right now but on the top let me just show you guys it just looks so so fantastic I love it how casual the look is and you can always make this scarf with like dressy more dressy with the outfit but I have casual lifestyle so this works so well it keeps you really warm but not too hot if that makes sense uh, I love denim shawl from Louis Vuitton but it kind of makes me really kind of hot for this time of year like uh, it's just a transition of getting really cold now so this works so so well I love the flange right there so this one and of course another one that I love it's another Burberry shawl that it is uh, the color ivory they call it and I got these uh, both of them at Neil Marcus or Nordstrom I think so I'll leave the link down below and so you can find the exact same one because they have so many different kinds and love 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 and they're uh, like half like price of the Louis Vuitton shawl so I think they're so gorgeous and it goes well and just makes your whole outfit put together that's how much I love and here is the pair of shoes that I've been loving you can tell I've been wearing a lot uh, yeah whenever we went uh, we went out of town last weekend uh, for uh, just a weekend trip and I wore this uh, like three days like just shopping or walking going to the park and everything uh, you can tell it looks really worn uh, but I really really love them and I cannot wait to have another pair of Chanel espadrilles you can tell this is Chanel espadrille size 37 that's my true to size and yeah I just wanted to tell you guys how much I loved and very 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 comfortable these are kind of flat I think it feels like there is no um, no you know it's really flat and uh like stiff i would say but the more i walk on them the more it gets more comfortable uh my feet and the favorite uh handbag of this month i chose two that one uh being bigger size i took this with me uh on the trip that we went um to atlanta i think three weeks ago or something like that and i took this <laughs> I think this handbag just draws attention from just anybody and everybody like even kids really liked it and just look at it like this it was so funny and in the elevator I mean wherever I go to people just talk about handbag and we start to just start to you know talk I mean it's like a, a conversation starter I, I will say I love it so much this is Louis Vuitton kimono color cherry it looks kind of loud or too much maybe for some people but I think they, this is so gorgeous and I love it so much let me know if you guys want me to make a review or something like that a video on that and the small size handbag Oh my goodness, I you guys know that I sold my mini uh, Chanel mini flap um, in the rectangular size uh, shape. This is the square shape lambskin red with the ruthenium hardware. As you guys can see, this is like lipstick red, like true, true red, like the cherry red from Louis Vuitton. I love it so much and you guys know that I sold my patent mini and I did say that I regret or it was a mistake to sell that but after wearing this oh my goodness no I don't regret at all I I I'm so glad that I sold the patent even though I just really really love it and I really love the 
square mini, I mean not square, sorry guys, rectangular patent mini so much. It's black with the silver hardware, even though it is black, it just pops in any outfit that I wear. But it was too dressy for my lifestyle, just saying, I don't know, I mean you guys may be different, but I just felt like it was too dressy just because it's so, so shiny and kind of blingy in a way. So whenever I wanted to wear a small size like, you know, the Chanel mini flap, I just felt like, no, it doesn't work for me right now. And then uh, next time, whenever I want to try it, I'm like, no, no, next time, you know, so I didn't really get to wear that bag that much. So <sighs> anyway, so I didn't do that. So I sold it and... I just wanted, you know, the mini actually black uh, caviar leather rectangular again, uh, the size, I mean the shape of it, but I don't know, I love this, this square and lambskin, very, very luxurious and I think it's so soft and I didn't really get any scratches. Uh, as of now, I know that it will get scratched and it will just look, you know, that you were. Um, but I love it and the red it goes really well with just I mean a lot of outfit even though you know some people may get afraid of having red color but I love it it's just basic color right now after wearing it so long uh, that's that and yeah I just wanted to share with you guys this um, very cute love it so that's all the favorite items that i have for this whole month uh i will get back with you another video and oh you know what forgot this is my favorite also this is the rolex watch that i just uploaded a video like review you know type of video so yeah this is the rolex watch that Sorry guys, somebody came now. I can hear the ring bell, so I gotta go. And yeah, if you guys are interested in knowing uh, more details on this watch, please go and check this, check the review out. Bye guys. Thank you for watching.